Focus on your breath. <clears throat> Try to gather all of your mind right around the breath. As for any of the pseudopods the mind might send out, just don't follow them. Try to bring things back in, back in. The mind is like an amoeba. It takes on all kinds of shapes. Sends out a thought to some place, and then the amoeba spreads out to that area. Then another thought to some place else, and it spreads out to that area. If they were to take a picture of your mind right now, how many pseudopods would it have? Try to have none going out at all. Just be right here, gathered around the breath. Think of the mind being like a, a ball of light right here. Perfectly self-contained, filling the whole body, surrounding the body with a, a little bit of awareness, but centered right in the tip of the nose, the middle of the chest, or wherever your focal point is. Because when the mind sends out its pseudopods, it, it's exposing itself to all kinds of trouble. It's laying, laying claim to things, but when you lay claim to things, then you're troubled with all the issues that come with those things. It's like owning a house. You think owning a house would be nice, but when you actually become the owner, you find you've got all kinds of responsibilities. And it leaves you exposed on all sides. It's like having a child. All of a sudden you realize all the dangers that there are in the world. So you try to bring everything back in and back in. Don't let the mind give birth to any little children. Don't let it send out any pseudopods. Just be right here. Be right here. Give the mind a chance to get to know itself inside. Because when it's heading outside, all of its awareness is focused out there. And it tends to miss a lot of what's going on inside. This is why greed, aversion, and delusion, fear and jealousy can start up inside the mind, and you don't really note it until it's reached a full-blown form. But when the mind is gathered in like this, the little tiny things that grow up in the mind, you notice them. If you're really clear, if you're really alert, if you're really centered right here. So try to maintain this sense of being centered well. And if the mind has to go out to something else, we'll make sure it's going out because it has a really good reason to go. Otherwise, try to keep things gathered right at the breath as you go through the day. Make this your center. Make this the center of your attention, the center of your interest. And you start seeing things inside that you never saw before. And at the same time, you find that the mind is a lot less exposed to the dangers outside. Because it realizes that the real dangers are the dangers inside, and you want to take care of them before they take over the mind. So try to get a sense of being at home here, feeling comfortable with the breath, allow the breath to flow smoothly. So the mind likes being here. And that way this the job it has here of watching itself is not onerous. It's a pleasant job, and a job that gives good results. <clears throat>